Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. It is the first week in November here and it's about 72, 73 degrees out and we're going to be doing some trolling. We are on a lake that's still open um, for open water fishing and we're hopefully going to go after, well, we have the chance to go after brook trout, splake, but we really came for the brown trout. This lake um, can hold some decent sized brown trout. So that's what we're kind of going after, but we'll take what we can get. Um, we get Josh's John boat here. So if you guys probably been watching the videos for a while, you've seen us uh, repaint his John boat. He has a 14 foot John boat. We'll kind of show you that in a little bit. We launched down here. Uh, it was pretty sketchy. I don't know if we're gonna make it or not. I think we might. It wasn't too bad, but I don't know if I could have got my bigger boat down here. So we're out in his little tiller and uh, hopefully gonna go after some trout. It's like 70 something degrees out, but it looks like on camera, it's pretty cold. But I'm sweating, we're in my sweatshirt here, but we're gonna see if we can get some trout. We're gonna use some crankbait, some Northeast Troller stuff, lead core fly rod, all kinds of different stuff. So we'll uh, show you what we're doing and hopefully, I think we're gonna get on some fish. So stay tuned. Yeah, should so be interesting. We have never, we've ice fished this pond a bunch, but we've never trolled it and the uh, Navionics maps are not accurate and not josh doesn't actually have a navionics map for this lake so we're gonna be we're gonna be charting it so i expect we're gonna be we're gonna be banging sand quite a bit northeast stroller you'll you'll stand by brown trout spoon orange with dot black dots we're in 20 feet i'm not gonna troll 20 feet i'm gonna do like two colors that'll be that'll be 16, 15, 16 feet. Not gonna quite put the color all the way in the water. Clicker, bail open. We're trolling. Moose look, wobbler. Copper with green. You'll stand by moose look wobbler. Okay, so we got two rods out. I gotta put my Crocs on. Yeah. I'm already sweating in those things. All right, boys, the fishing starts now. Ow! See, that's a fish. That's a fish. <laughs> Dude, I got to look at my feet. <laughs> look at my feet. Is it a trout or? Oh, wait, I think it is. It's falling. <laughs> Might be a splake. Looking kind of splakey. I didn't take very long. Oh, it's a little boy. That's a splake. Pretty sure. Yeah. All right. <laughs> yep. Splake. Splake Shelton. Splake Shelton. All right, guys. We just got a little, a little baby splake. If you guys don't know what a splake is, it's a cross between a brook trout and a lake trout. And that's what they look like. They look kind of like brook trout mostly, but that took about, I don't know. A minute yeah. into trolling, so all right. Josh has a fish, he's going. Oh, I got one, and that's the bottom. Oh, that was bottom. I was on bottom. Oh, you got a stick. No, you don't. You got a fish. Oh, he's right there. <laughs> there we go. That's a decent splake. Another splake, baby. Splakey Splake, Splake Shelton. Well, that's a that's a better one. Splake again. Not bad. Not bad at all. Sick. Only been out here for like 20 minutes. Northeast Troller, we've got the little bit bigger spoon here. Link them down in the description below. Caught a couple fish on them already, but this is a little bit bigger. Going with the going with the copper color it's pretty overcast right now got the sinking fly line here on this rod 
I'm not going to put it too far back because we don't really know. We already snag bottom a couple times. You know what I could do is put that rod with the mono out and just put a... Oh, I got a fish. I got a fish. That's a fish. Dude, it's right there. <laughs> right when you picked up. <laughs> and I, it's probably another splake. Come on, buddy. Here he comes. Sweet. We got a, another splake here. And if you're wondering how you can tell a splake from a brook trout, they usually don't have the blue halos. As you can see here, they got more of a lake trout head. They got more of a pointed lake trout head and they got their teeth are usually pretty prominent in there like the lake trout are and they just they're more like long and slender seems like when they're this size anyways and they have more of a forked tail usually some perch we'll find out in minutes if they come up oh yeah i got the motor oh i got one too uh oh uh oh double double <laughs> i can see mine unless we're hooked together nope we're not we got the same fish no yours is right there okay no nope. wait what's going on wait. We got two fish on. <laughs> you get yours in here. <laughs> <laughs> Double anyways. I don't know what's going on with this though. <laughs> oh yeah, I heard that fly rod buzzing. Alright. Double splakes, baby. <laughs> Alright, now we gotta fix this mess. Well, there's one. And there's Josh's, another splake. <laughs> Double. Get out of there, jeez. <laughs> oh, popped right off. Sweet. Quick nice. release. Like baby. Oh. Splake baby. Thanks for the fight. That's bottom. That's bottom. <laughs> bottom. Oh, you got a fish. Shoot. I'm gonna turn the boat so I can go try to retrieve it. Oh, that's a decent one, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Shit, yo. Is that a brown or no? Dude, that's a that's a fish. Oh, dude, that's a good, that's a good splay. Right oh, that's a brook trout. Yeah. That is a brook trout. Yeah. Not a bad one either. Well, there you go. There's a brook trout. That's a decent one. It's probably, I don't know, how big is that? 16. 15, yeah. 16, 20. 14. I see it's got halos. Mm -hmm. so, not a bad one. Sweet.
That one feels a little better. But maybe it's just because we're going faster with the wind. I don't think it's that. It might be a brown, but I don't, it doesn't feel like it's massive. It's probably just because we're... Huh? Yeah. Oh, it might be brown. Stay on. Stay on. Yeah, feeling, feeling splaky with the head shakes. Nope, it's not a brown. <laughs> Big ol' splake. Been a little bit, but another splake. Still haven't found the elusive brown trout yet. Working on it. Oh, you go, you go, you go. Yeah, he's on. He's on. <laughs> Is he still on? Yeah. No, he's out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I forgot about that. Came off? Yeah. Dang. <laughs> yeah. They like the orange. Oh, another one. <laughs> oh, whoa. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Holy smokes, dude. You got into a mess of them right there. That's a nice colored up one. It's, a, it's another splake. This is a nice colored up splake here. <laughs> Damn eel, dude. Well, that's that, folks. Yeah. Yeah, go easy. Oh, 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 oh. Um, no, you're good. A little tight getting in here. Yeah, baby. Yep, you're good. Yep. Yeah, baby. All right, so the wind picked up. We had to get off the lake, but uh, I don't know how many fish we caught. Probably 15 or so. We lost a bunch and had a pretty steady action, so we're happy with that. The wind picked up and uh, we had to get off the lake because it was just too much for the little boat we were on. So, but anyway, short little video for you guys. Got a few splake. We didn't get the brown trout we were after. Couldn't find them, but we kind of were. We're kind of stuck to troll in one little area here once the wind picked up. So. We'll come back again this spring probably, and maybe we'll get some browns then. If you guys uh, like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Catch you in the next video.